Find smart TV manufacturers who do not make iPlayer prominent, BBC says. Smart TV manufacturers who fail to make iPlayer prominent and easily accessible could be fined £250,000 according to proposals from the BBC. The broadcaster has called on regulator Ofcom to urgently introduce legislation to benefit public service broadcasters. In a response to Ofcom's public service broadcasting review, Claire Sumner, the director of policy at the BBC, said... Legislation should prevent providers of TV user interfaces, i.e. smart TVs or global tech providers, from releasing products in the UK without complying with these rules. Now, to me, this just sounds completely and utterly ridiculous. Let me show you something. This is the remote from my current smart TV. You probably can't see it too clearly. But there is a button that says Netflix, and there is a button that says Amazon Prime. Now, those things are built into the TV, not because the TV manufacturer was made to put them there. It's put there because people want them there. People want to use them. I use that Netflix button all the time. That's how I access Netflix. I pick up my remote, I go bang, Netflix. But if I didn't want Netflix on my TV, I can remove it and I can reassign that button to do anything that I want. Now the problem is so many people think that if you can access BBC services, you do need to pay for a license fee. So the BBC aren't stupid, that's why they're doing this. They want every telly to have a non-removable iPlayer app on there with a dedicated button so that you can hit it. And then everybody's going to think, or normal people out there, not us converted people, are going to think that they're going to have to pay the license fee because their telly can do iPlayer. And it's just Gestapo tactics, isn't it? It's absolutely shocking. People are leaving us. People are turning against us. So we're going to force them, in, or they think they're going to force us into paying for something. You know, it's Crazy. They're not winning. They know the tide is turning, so they're trying these crazy Gestapo tactics. And I think this one is, is well off. And I would not buy a TV that had iPlayer built in. I just wouldn't do it. And I'm going to tell you why in a future video that I'm making, as I said earlier, just getting it all put together now so it'll be on the channel soon. And what if I had to buy a TV set up today, what I would buy to avoid the BBC. And the answer may actually surprise a few of you out there as well. So keep tuned for that video. A few days' time, that'll be live. Uh, there's other videos on the channel you can take a look at. In the meantime, go and have a watch, and I will see you in another video again soon. Thank you for watching.